topic for this video is about passion for success. Um, I seen a video that Arnold Schwarzenegger do, which I'll put a link for that, and he talked about passion. So uh, a topic here is about what is your passion? Uh, some assumptions here, you know, maybe you're an MBA student, a college student, or, you know, work, whatever it is, and you have things going on in life, and uh, maybe you are, maybe you're not where you want to be. And, uh, you know, when we talk about what's passion, uh, what did you love to do when you were a kid? Uh, you know, we all have dreams, you know, playing, you know, you know, whatever the case is. Uh, but another question might be to ask is, what did you love to do? As we grow up, we find out things may not necessarily go the way we want, depending on our background, where we came from, you know, opportunities, whatever the case is, you know, sometimes things don't work out the way that they, they should, or they do. We grow up and everything's perfect. We got the perfect job, we're smiling, happy, but then again, maybe we're miserable. You know, things didn't work out and you have to ask yourself, what happened? why are we not where we want it to be? And I use myself as an example uh, about regardless of your background. You know, when I was a, a kid, you know, my parents got divorced, so my mother took me over to Ireland for about four years. And uh, that's me on the right when I was a little guy, but I uh, lived in a house. This is not a picture of the house, but this is pretty much the same thing. There was a house next to the side of the road, a uh, detached roof. Uh, electricity had just been put in. This was like in 1962. Uh, they just got electricity, so there was one light bulb in the house. There was no bathroom, no water, or anything like that. Uh, thanks to the marvels of Google, I was actually able to find a water pump down the road, about a half mile walk down the road, but uh, that's the water pump there in the middle. Uh, so about an hour round trip to go get a couple bu buckets of water. But anyway, my point is background. Everybody, you know, everybody has diverse backgrounds. We come from different things but sometimes we want to use excuses we want to blame life we, you know where we came from our presumed station or status in life oh because of this or that you know I, I don't have the opportunity uh, I got a picture of Philadelphia here one of my memories of Philadelphia is in a lot of the streets depending on which neighborhood I was driving through uh, there was no cars and that's because people couldn't afford cars and again you know my point is you know regardless of your background you know what do you want to do uh, you can use excuses, you can let distractors get you, you can let obstacles stop you, or you can have a passion for what you want to do. If your passion is crawling through the mud, hey, great, that's your passion, but you have to have that zeal, uh, desire to do it. Uh, you know, the, the Arnold uh, link I'll have in here, you know, he talks about passion. Having a passion for success, you know, wanting to succeed, uh, you have to want it and go for it. Uh, not just think about it, talk about it, look at it, you know, have a conversation with your friend about it. You have to actually go do it, and you have to have a passion for that. You don't let distractors stop you. Uh, sometimes, you know, there's these distractors in our lives that just, you know, set us off course. Don't get sidetracked by someone else's agenda. Lots of people, be it one person that's a friend, uh, a group, whatever the case is, sometimes they have their own agendas in life, and they want to include you in it. And maybe that's not for you, or maybe it is, but if you're letting it distract you from your things that you're wanting to do, then you need to, you need to stop that. Uh, you need to go for your dreams, your goals, your passion. Uh, don't let anyone stop you and take charge of your life, take charge of your goals, take charge of your passion for success. Passion for success, you have to have that. And if you don't, you need to find it and go for it.